select the prop stage. Put it on the desk and make the back side upward. Select the elbow tweezers. Lift the prop, press prop stitch with left hand. Then the flat spring will give a space in the slot. Insert the prop tail into the space. Release your left hand, push the prop into the slot slightly. There's a tiny straight verge on the prop which will stand against the slot borderline. Stop pushing if you can't go further. Turn over the pop stage and insert it. Take out the specimen. Select the straight tweezers. Put the simple on a simple stage. Add the software. Choose solution. Insert the calibration card above the prop stage. Then do the electric calibration. First, turn off the illuminator. It will help us to observe the laser's working condition. There are four knobs on the head of scanner. There are knob A, B, C, and D from left to right. Knob A and B work for controlling PSD position. PSD works for accepting laser signal. Knob C and D work for controlling laser transmitter to make sure that laser hit on the prop can't deliver. When laser irradiate on the cantilever, it will make a diffraction spot on the mirror. We can clearly observe the diffraction spot on space under the second mirror after reflection. We can judge the laser position on the cantilever by observing the shape of diffraction spot. Adjust knob C and D until the laser reach the right position on the cantilever. Rotate knob C clockwise to move laser further apart from our side. Rotate knob C counterclockwise to move the laser closer toward our side. Rotate knob D clockwise to move the laser left. Rotate knob D counterclockwise to move the laser right. Adjust knob C and D continuously until the laser reach the right position on the cantilever with the right diffraction spot. This is the position of PSD. This is the position of laser transmitter. The laser light reflected by the cantilever and shoot on the PSD. The PSD accept light signal and transfer the signal to software. Since the cantilever is fixed, we need to adjust the position of laser transmitter and PSD to make sure they are ready for duty. After adjusting the diffraction spot, we need to rotate knob A and B to make sure that the PSD is at the right position to accept the laser signal. Rotate knob A clockwise to move PSD right and the rest spot will move upward on the software. Rotate knob A counterclockwise to move PSD left and the rest spot will move downward on the software. Rotate knob B clockwise to move the PSD further apart from our side and the rest spot will move to right on the software. Rotate knob B counterclockwise to move PSD closer to our side and the rest spot will move to left on the software. 
the movement of the rest board on software should be synchronous with our adjustment, and the energy bar should not have large fluctuation. We should make the rest board on the crossings of the software by rotating the A and B. The system parameters. Before testing, move the sample right below the prop. Turn the knob on the right side. After we put the sample under the prop, we push the red button to continuously make them closer. Observe their movement. Stop when their distance is approximately 2mm and switch to software auto-approaching.